God is protecting you from a bad relationship. God promises to save us in scriptures. Some signs he is protecting you from a bad relationship might be something like the feeling that the person on your side is not the one for you or an intuition that this person is not good for your life. But sometimes it can be hard to tell if they are really bad. Sometimes relationships stay tough even when we think they should be getting better. To find out how God will save you, turn to some of his signs. It's not something that most people think about, having a bad relationship. We go into them hoping and wanting to see the good in them, or want to believe they contain this hidden treasure that we can find if we look hard enough. But when things start deteriorating, it is fun to imagine ways you may have been able to avoid entering this troubled scenario altogether. However, sometimes they seem so inevitable that there seems nothing you can do to escape them. God does not want you to be in a bad relationship. No matter how it started, most relationships go through their ups and downs. Sometimes we find ourselves in tough times, but do we really have to stay in an unhealthy one? No. In fact, God may be trying to protect you from a bad relationship by giving you signs that it is not right. Remember, God always has a plan for you and will never allow you to experience anything you don't want. In fact, he might be guiding you away from a bad relationship to protect you. A bad relationship is not right for you, period. You are not compatible with this person and they do not respect or appreciate you. There are many things that can lead to a bad relationship. Maybe you and your partner have different expectations of each other or you find it hard to communicate. Whatever the reason, it's important to remember that God doesn't want you in a bad relationship. He wants you to be safe and happy. Why God does not want you to be in a bad relationship God has a specific plan for your life and he will not allow you to be in a bad relationship. There are many reasons why God would want you to stay away from a bad relationship, and here are five of the most important. The first one is because bad relationships can cause great harm to both parties involved. Both people in a bad relationship often end up feeling resentful, angry, and hurt. This can lead to problems at home, at work, and in your social life. Your relationship with God is a reflection of your relationship with other people. If you are in a bad relationship, your relationship with God will be affected, too. Here are some signs that God is protecting you from a bad relationship. Secondly, a bad relationship is never based on true love. In a good relationship, each person respects the other's opinions and values. A bad relationship, on the other hand, is typically based on domination, possession, or gratifying personal desires instead of love. This type of love is unstable and cannot last. God is always working our lives to protect us from bad relationships. We need to trust Him and follow His guidance in order to find lasting love and happiness. If we allow God to work in our lives, He can help us avoid getting caught up in a bad relationship. One reason why a bad relationship is never based on true love is because love involves giving without expecting anything in return. When one person constantly takes what holds and criticizes, it creates an imbalance in the relationship that cannot stand up to the test of time. God protects us from bad relationships because they lead to heartache, loneliness, and disappointment. If you are feeling upset or lonely in your relationship, it may be time to take a step back and reassess your situation. Sometimes the simplest solution is the best one, which is prayer, texting friends, or talking to a professional. When we walk away from a relationship that isn't good for us, we are allowing God to work his heart out through us. So do not be ashamed of yourselves, rather be proud of what you are because God has made you what you are. When we humble ourselves and admit our weaknesses instead of trying to make everything perfect, God can do great things in our lives. God is protecting you from a bad relationship. First, this means that we must avoid getting involved with people who are unavailable or irresponsible. Second, it means that we must never let a harmful or destructive relationship control our lives. Good relationships are founded on compromise and respect, but a bad relationship often relies on dominance and control. A bad relationship is never based on true love. In a good relationship, each person respects the other's opinions and values. A bad relationship, on the other hand, is typically based on domination, possession, or gratifying personal desires instead of love. This type of love is unstable and cannot last. Therefore, if you are in a situation where your partner does not share your same values or interests, it may be time to move on. God is protecting you from a bad relationship and will help you find a more suitable one. Thirdly, another reason why God is protecting you from a bad relationship is because a bad relationship is insecure and full of fear. In a good relationship, both people know their roles in the relationship and have trust in each other. A bad relationship is filled with secrets, accusations, and mistrust. This creates anxiety and makes it difficult for either person to open up honestly with the other. God is always protecting you from a bad relationship. 
He brings comfort, reassurance, and security in good relationships. And by understanding your role in a good relationship, you can allow God to help you find comfort and assurance in His plans for your life. God is always working to protect you from a bad relationship. When you are in a good relationship, both people understand their place in the relationship and trust each other. This allows for communication and honest interaction, which makes it easier to stay safe and connected. If you are in a bad relationship, remember that God is with you and will help protect you from harm. Talk to him about your situation and ask for his guidance. He will help guide you away from a bad relationship and towards a better one. Also, a bad relationship destroys hope and optimism. A good relationship builds hope and optimism. It's easier to walk the path of darkness with someone waiting at the other side, but in a good relationship, forgiveness is possible, and hope is allowed to bloom once more. When you're trying to make a break from a bad relationship, it's important to remember that you're not alone. God is on your side, and He wants you to get out safely. When a relationship starts to go bad, hope slowly dies. It's harder to see the good in life when all you can see is the bad. And it's even harder to find hope in a bad relationship when that relationship has been built on fear and mistrust. A good relationship, however, builds hope because it helps us see that we are not alone. In a good relationship, forgiveness is possible because we know that our partner is doing their best. And hope is allowed to bloom because we know that we am each other. Relationships are about more than love, they are about relationships and trust. When a relationship starts going bad, hope slowly dies. It's harder to see the good in life when all you can see is the bad. But when a good relationship starts to shine through, hope springs back to life once again and optimism blankets everything in its light. Another reason why God is protecting you from a bad relationship is because a bad relationship keeps control over love between two people. A good relationship chooses to let go of control so that its members may learn how to be there for each other as they need one another rather than as needed by someone else. When love reigns supreme, decisions are not made by other people but by those who love one another equally even though they don't always agree or see eye to eye or think alike on everything. Bad relationships control what love is between two people by dictating what is allowed and what is not allowed. They force two people to act a certain way in order to keep the relationship together which removes love from the equation. Instead of choosing freedom and allowing the relationship to grow and change as both people do, bad relationships try to keep things exactly how they were before backwards. Good relationships let go of the need for control in order to create a space for growth and learning. When love is allowed to reign supreme, both parties are happier because they can be themselves without worrying about whether or not their actions will upset the other. The freedom to be ourselves allows us to learn how to best support and care for each other, no matter how different our beliefs may be. A bad relationship is based on abuse and manipulation, lies told in an attempt to have one or both of the people in the relationship think that they are loved when they're not. A good relationships love each other as God loves us without condition or manipulation and allows freedom to flow again once love begins. When we enter into a relationship with someone, we inherently do so with the understanding that it will be imperfect. What makes a good relationship great is not a lack of weakness, but rather the strength of love and commitment to sacrifice their best for one another. God is constantly protecting us from a bad relationship by providing for our needs in other areas of our life. He may not always answer our prayers immediately but He's always working on behalf of us. When we let go and rely on Him, He will deliver us from anything. Signs God uses to protect you from a bad relationship. In today's society, relationships are often considered to be the cornerstone of everything. It can be difficult to imagine life without them. However, this doesn't mean that all relationships are good or that they will last forever. In fact, a lot of times the relationships we think are great turn out to be bad for us. This is particularly true when it comes to romantic relationships. Sometimes things just don't work out and people end up getting hurt. This isn't always the fault of either party involved though. Sometimes it can be due to external factors that neither person can control. However, even in difficult situations, God is still working to protect you. He knows what is best for you and He will never let anything bad happen to you unless it is His own will. God uses different signs to remind us that He is protecting us from a bad relationship. He may give us a warning before a problem becomes a disaster or He may give us the strength to end a bad relationship before it gets too serious. Here are five signs that God is protecting you from a bad relationship. Number one, you notice warning signs. If there are warning signs that something is going wrong, it's probably best to heed them and end the relationship before it escalates. Pay attention to your body. If you're constantly sick or having nightmares, it's time to reconsider continuing the relationship. Also, think about the things your partner says and does that bother you if they repeatedly talk about breaking up or behaving in ways that make you feel uncomfortable, it's probably time to end things. Number two, you don't feel safe in the relationship. 
If you're constantly feeling unsafe or like you don't have any control in the relationship, it's probably time to end things before they get too serious. If your partner regularly hits you or speaks harshly to you, it doesn't feel safe to stay in a relationship. Don't put up with bad behavior for long. It can be hard to avoid a bad relationship, but God is always working behind the scenes to keep you safe. If you don't feel ready for a serious relationship yet, it's a sign that God is protecting you. Also, if you start to change your behavior in order to get away from this person, then the relationship is not good for you. If things between you and this person start to become negative and destructive, it may be time to walk away. If you find yourself spending more and more time away from this person, trying to rebuild your life elsewhere, then you are not meant to be together. Finally, if you suddenly realize that you're not happy with this person, and that they're not happy with you either, it is a sign that God is protecting you from a bad relationship. May God help you in Jesus' name. Amen.